We're back for another reaction video. This one is for Game of Thrones Season 5, Episode 5. Kill the Boy. Season 5 we have um, Arya going to Bravos, meeting up with Jack and Hagar, or actually the man without a face, or the man who has no name, or the man is no man. How I want to call it. Um, we had a Therion situation where Therion is being captured by Jorah where he said to take him to the Queen and I thought immediately um, about Cersei because why would he say the Queen? When he addresses um, Daenerys he said he talks about uh, Khaleesi so after all it meant that he was taking him to Khaleesi to Daenerys while he was already going to Daenerys with Varys so I'm not sure what you're going to take there, but since Grey Worm and Sir Barristan has have been stabbed and maybe even wounded or even killed, actually they are wounded, maybe even killed, I hope not by the way because I really like Grey Worm, but they are building him up in the last couple episodes with, um, um, I don't know what her name is, a couple of people here. Like uh, a couple of people in the comments said what her name is, but I forgot. It's the um, the woman counselor of Daenerys, and they're building him up with her being uh, they, them being in love or something like that. So it might it might even be that he's dead. We don't know yet. Sebastian, he was he looked very badly. So maybe they're both dead. I'm I'm not sure. I don't know. Um, we got a Daenerys situation in a Marine where she killed a um, a slave because he, he he brought down the son of Harpy and um, he thought at least they um, Daenerys um, executed him, cut let him cut off, let let Daenerys, uh, Dario and Harris cut off his head, and now she has a very big situation. She's actually, it, lo it almost looks like she's le losing everything. Um, she's losing the control over her dragons, she's losing the control over her slaves as well. She's probably now losing Grey Worm and Sir Barristan. But if we're correct, um, gaining Jorah back. Um, we also got Jon Snow uh, being now Lord Commander, but Stannis wants him as a Stark so he could give Stannis the North. Um, he doesn't want it, he wants to be Lord Commander. The Red Woman visited him, uh, wanted to have sex with him. That's something what I what I thought of. Uh, she said, you know nothing Jon Snow, but he touched her, um, let's just say, pussy as well as her tits. So maybe because of that, touching his fingers, maybe he can see into, into him. I'm not sure, but it was very, uh, very interesting why she said, um, you know nothing Jon Snow. Yeah, I'm really curious. Also, we got in um, in uh, House Martell or in uh, Dorne, we got the the ex girlfriend of Oberyn with her three daughters. I'm not sure if if it I'm I kind of forgot if it were uh, if they were uh, the, um, Oberyn's daughters, but they are going to try and go against war to uh, Cersei. And they th they're thinking about um, chopping up um, Myrcella. It was Myrcella, right? And sending her back to uh, King's Landing, piece by piece. It's a real, real complicated situation at this moment. The season five is not as strong as season four is, but still, I'm enjoying it, enjoying it pretty much. And oh yeah, Jamie uh, and Bron are in Dorne looking for Marcella. A lot of shit is happening in season 5. Let's just go in this episode because I'm really, really curious. It's Kill the Boy. Which boy would it be? Bran? Rickon? Um, 
how many boys we got more uh, we got um, we got Brent Rick and we got how is that boy called Tom we got a lot of a lot of younger players in it so I'm really curious well, let's go hit it off season 5 episode 5 kill a boy well, let's go oh he's alive he's only wounded he's dead holy fuck he fought well Round up the leaders of each of Marine's great families and bring them to me. But Ooh. I'm the leader of my family. <laughs> I have nothing to do with this! You're great! Yo, they're gonna be burned alive. <laughs> Holy fuck, they're gonna be eaten by CGI dragons. <laughs> oh shit! You can always say that you're eat, you're eating by CGI dragons in the in the gray shell. There is. Here we go. Wow. Fucking hell. Holy shit. One by fucking one. Even when he's fucking wow. Burning and all. <laughs> He's the only one standing up. Don't want to overfeed them. Wow, his foot is fucking still twitching. Holy shit. Wow. And though Daenerys maintains her grip on Slaver's Bay, forces rise against her from within and without. She refuses to leave until the freedom of the former slaves is secure. She sounds like quite a woman. And she's alone. What's in this? Under siege. No family to guide her. Who sent this to fucking Castle Black? The last relation, thousands of miles away. Useless. Dying. Don't say that, Mr. Raymond. The Targaryen. Alone in the world. How are you feeling? Oh, like a hundred year old man <laughs> slowly <laughs> freezing to death. I so like him. Half the men hate you already, Lord Commander. Do it. <laughs> What's he gonna you do? You don't know what it is. That doesn't matter. You do. <clears throat> wow, the confident the man confident joy in your command. But with luck, you will find the strength to do what needs to be done. Kill the boy, John Snow. Winter is almost upon us. Kill the boy. And let the man be born. For eight thousand years, the Night's Watch have sworn an oath to be the shield that guards the realms of men. And for eight thousand years, we've fallen short of that oath. You belong to the realms of men. All of you. And now everything is going to change. It is. Why now? Because now... I am Lord Commander of the Night's Watch. What would you have me do? <clears throat> Lord, Lord Commander. Commander. <laughs> and if we go north of the wall, gather the remaining free folk, wherever they are, and bring them back here. I'll open the gates for them and let them through. I'll find wow. them lands. It's a risky choice. Of the wall. They won't kneel for you. You're too proud to make peace. Holy shit, that is such a smart man. He, he's become such a short, sh Maybe you're just a coward. smart man. Oh. <laughs> Easy thing to say to a man in chains. Your people need a leader. And they need to get south of the wall before it's too late. We don't have much time and they have less. The walkers are coming and they'll hit your people first. I will follow you anywhere. You know them. 
<laughs> and they killed Gren. Yes. And they killed Pip. Yes. They killed 50 of our brothers. I can't forget that. I can't forgive it. I know what it's like to lose the people you love. I know this is hard for you. But winter is coming. We know what's coming with it. We can't face it alone. You're mine. You're not going anywhere. Unless I have to listen to more of your jealousy. Jealousy bores me. You remember what happens to people who bore me. Hmm. You're not going to bore me. Are you, Miranda? Hope she's going to kill you. <laughs> One moment, we are not watching, we are not paying attention. Cut that knife through his chipped throat. You still have friends in the north. If you're ever in trouble, light a candle in the highest window of the broken tower. But who? You're not alone. It's good. It's very good. I said it reek. It reeks. So I'd like to drink to our wedding. May our happiness spread from Moat Kaelin to the last half. To your wedding. To your wedding. <laughs> mm. <laughs> Lost her appetite. <laughs> he must be He's a new man. A new person. Anyway. Aren't you Reek? It's Master. He's no man anymore. What's your name? Why are you doing this? <clears throat> because Reek has something to say to She's you. seen en enough torturing. Don't you, Reek? But if you would have done that, there w would be no possible apology I'm for sorry. that. Sorry about what? For killing your brothers. You know what, my lady? What with him having murdered your brothers and the rest of your family gone, Reek here is the nearest thing to a living king oh, shit. that you have left. Reek! You will give away the bride. But someone has to. Really? What better person? Good? Good? She had enough torturing. Yes, yes, very good. Since we're all together. She pregnant? She's fucking pregnant, right? We're going to have a baby. Oh fucking hell. He's not gonna like that. He's not gonna I'm like happy that. For you. From the way she's carrying, Mr. Wilkins says it looks like a boy. Oh shit, he's not gonna like that. And he already lost his appetite. Oh look at Sansa. <laughs> oh she got a little bit of grass back at that moment. Like, fuck you, motherfucker. How torture me, I torture you, bitch. <laughs> You've never asked me about your mother. <laughs> Why would I? <laughs> she had me, she died. And the story, right? Here we are. She was a peasant girl. Pretty in a common sort of way. She was the miller's wife. Apparently they'd married without my knowledge or consent. So I had him hanged. No. And I took her beneath the tree where he was swaying. Okay, so she that's where he got the torturing time. from. She was lucky I didn't hang her too. A year later she came to my gates with a squalling baby in her arms. A baby she claimed was mine. I nearly had her whipped. <laughs> the child thrown in the river. But then I looked at you, and I saw then what I see now. You are my son. Getting him back into his grasp. He almost lost him, so he cooked up this story. If it's true or not. Stannis Barat. Lady Melisandre told me that death marches on the wall. I've seen it, your grace. Seen what? Walker. The army of the dead. When they come, 
We have to know how to fight them. Hmm. Keep reading. Someone tell me. <laughs> wow, that's probably a, a big honor for him to get it from Stannis. I need those ships. You get them back. Oh, you got it done. Very cool team song, by the way. Stark's team song mixed with the uh, Baratheons, if I heard it right. I am afraid. What? I'm afraid death. No. Not death. To lose you? I fear. I never again see Miss Sunday from the island of Nath. Fuck. 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 That's why men shouldn't have women because or children because then they're afraid of losing them it's the oldest thing in 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 every every war every soldier every army you could better have an army of men who don't love anyone have no family have no children because you got nothing to lose right you cannot fight anymore right now I can only tell you what I have seen, Your Grace. I have seen you listen to your counselors. I have seen you lean on their experience when your own was lacking, and weigh the choices they put before you. And I have seen you ignore your counselors. Fuck yeah. Tell her the truth, Miss Sunday. Because there was a better choice. <clears throat> One that only you could see. Okay, fuck. <laughs> I will marry the leader of an ancient family. What? Thankfully, a suitor is already on his knees. What? Like, what the fuck? First, I was gonna die. Get eaten by a fucking dragon. Then, get a fucking prisoner. Then, her coming back and telling she was so wrong. And then, she's gonna fucking marry me. Holy shit. But it's a bold choice. I apologize for before. My mouth sometimes runs away from me. This so I'm going to, to try it in a different way. Political way. <clears throat> he found an what opening. What would make our time together truly enjoyable would be some wine. <laughs> no wine. I am a person who drinks. <laughs> it's Drogon. Holy shit, he must be fucking suck. He must, he must be losing his mind, right? He must be thinking he's losing his mind. From the rehab, from drinking. Holy fuck. Okay, now he's, he's, uh oh, uh oh. What the, f who the fuck? Who the fuck is that? Who the fuck was that? Oh shit, he fucking dropped in the water. This is on a boat again. Tyrion. But is he touched? Tyrion. Tyrion. Did he got touched on the skin? You're all right. <laughs> oh shit, no. <clears throat> Fuck. Already? That soon? But if he touches Therion, what he didn't do, I think, 
at least I hope not on the skin, Theron gets gray skin too. What a crazy end of the fucking episode, right? They always do this on the fucking end of the episode. <clears throat> okay, let's recap this. Um, Grey Worm is still alive, I'm glad for it, but since he got to love me Sunday, he's doomed. He's fucking doomed. Like I said in the, in the reaction, oh, an army would would have been better off without loving someone because they they got nothing to lose, right? So if they got no children, no family, no wife, they got nothing to lose. So they go in bawling, you know. So even if they die, they they kill like ten others. They never see. Um, she she fed one of the element to uh, to her dragons they 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 fried him alive burn him alive and then eat him when he was alive and after all that shit he they she got them back to a prison and she married the guy with the curly hair she's gonna marry him because of the uh, the bond they get then it's a very smart smart decision but I think it will only be in name only that marriage because I don't think she would marry him. Um, Jon Snow is going with uh, Tormund to the to the Wild Walker to the Wildlings. Wild Walkers, what the hell? <laughs> to the Wildlings and to convince them to fight with Jon Snow against the Wild Walkers and whatever else. Stannis is going to go to the Boltons. Uh, Rule Bolton has shot his load into his wife, which. I don't know why he got in love with, and he got her pregnant. He kicked her a baby in it. Awesome. <laughs> because Ramsey did not like that because it's probably going to be a son, and he fears for his position. That's why Rev. That's why Rose Bolton. He cooked up a plan, cooked up a story to get him back in his grasp and to ask him for his help against the. Stannis Baratheon's army who was going, going to get into um, Winterfell. Um, Sansa saw Reek, or better said, at Theon, but I don't, I'm not sure why Miranda uh, brought her there. Torture, or maybe it was Ramsay's idea after all to bring her there to, to get her tortured like that, but. I said in the reaction she had enough torture already, but there's a, a side note in that every moment of torture that she get, she gets more, um, I say, more blunt, and I think that's why she's changing her appearance, her uh, clothing, and she's getting more blunt with the day. So she's getting hardened, toughen up. She was this stupid little mouse, you know, and like she said to Littlefinger, I'm a stupid little girl uh, who who can't lie and stuff like that. And she she toughens up. She hasn't been lying, I think, in a long while, and she looked um, darker. Um, and I think uh, I think I think it will toughen her up to uh, yeah. <laughs> I think it will help her. So get her, give her more torture. As long as she's not dying, I mean, uh, whatever doesn't kill you makes you stronger, right? It's it's not said for nothing. <clears throat> the plan of Jon Snow didn't fail right uh, to his fellow men to sign up with the wildlings. Samuel Charlie had this uh, um, small talk with Stannis Baratheon about his father and he told him his father uh, Randy Tarly fought Robert Baratheon in the war and he defeated him that was the only war he lost Robert Baratheon that's pretty awesome pretty awesome and he now knows that that Sam knows how to kill White Walker so he wants him to find out why this dragon glass kills him kills a White Walker really good episode really enjoyed it I'm so I'm so fucking hyped for for Game of Thrones I just want to go binge it all the way because I really want to go to season seven. I really want to know whatever happens to all those characters if they die, if they not die. Um, there are a good bunch that I really need to get to see dying. I, I want to see Ramsey die, 
to search it that I, I want to see um, I want to see a lot of other people die and uh, yeah, I'm really really curious so if you like my reaction please give a thumbs up if you want to see the next episode early go to patreon patreon link is in the description down below it's not a clickable link I don't know why but the link is there um, okay maximum time of uh, recording is over so I need to speed this up if you want you can share this around if you have uh, not already then please subscribe to my channel while you're at it click the little bell and you will automatically update when a new video coming out thank you for watching and I'll definitely see you back for the next reaction video ciao